row. <laughs> Mafia, what's going on, gang? And I'm back, you know. I was gone a couple days because I got some family issues going. You feel me? Y'all know how that go. You feel me? Y'all can't be mad at me for that. You feel me? I'm human. I got issues too. But besides that, as you see from the title, we're doing the second dance from Nick Cannon. Y'all, I am just so convinced that this man loves embarrassment. Like, the first one was already god awful so it makes me just curious of how much worse it can get so that's what we're here for today and those who are new to my channel hi i'm imani by government but you're here because chocolate money you feel what i'm saying so we're gonna dive right into this this you feel me uh i'm not exactly sure who he all got on this one hopefully he came with some better bars because they I, I wasn't impressed man from the last one i'm gonna be real with you but uh I already told you a little bit of the backstory. I guess it has something to do with him saying something about Mariah and Nick felt like he had to come to her defense and honor and just humiliated himself. So let's then dive right into it. So this one specifically came out three years ago. It got 4 million views, you know, not as many as the first one did. First one, I think it was like 15. So now this one at four, cause you know, everybody like, come on man, like that shit was ass. So they not finna come back and see the second one if the first one was ass, you feel what I'm saying? So unless you like me, you want to see how worse it can get. So we're going to dive right into it, man. We ain't finna waste no time. I'm finna be laughing my ass off. This shit finna get serious. So let's go, man. Yeah. Damn. Remember what Ice Cube said? Oh, yeah. It ain't over, motherfucker. There's a lot. And then he thought he was, <laughs> he thought he was being cool. Even Ice Cube don't claim this, man. Like... Come on, bro. Not he started out cringe. He's so corny, bro. There, they, you know, was a little. Here's what they think harsh. about you. Here's what they think about you. This is so disrespectful. Here's what they think about you. 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 At least he did some of his homework. You feel me? At least he did his homework, you know, and uh, brought up some of the lyrics that M has said. But that's the only thing I can give him right now. But this shit mad corny. Here's what they think about you. 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 Now, y'all should know how M is. Like, he gonna say whatever he want to say, bro. He don't care about the consequences because that's just him. But anyway. How would you feel like in a sort of eight mile battle contest with Nick Cannon? I think that's really where you're going to feel some swag pressure right now because it's on, baby. He's so cringe, bro. Get to the song, bro. You and him will have to go. Here's what they think about you. think he does so much. Solid ass yeah, they do, I didn't plan on taking it to that level, man. I just you, you, wanted to, you, you know, know what I mean? Like, like I didn't want to get to that level. It might be on the losing team. Hopefully, it doesn't. But here's what they think about. Here's what they think about. Here's what they think about. Oh, my God. See, you can't help you know what it is. Here's what they think about. Y'all, he's dragging this out, and it's pissing me off, man. Like... Come on, Nick, bro. We don't give a damn, bro. Just get into the song. We know what M said, bro. Here's what they think about you. Here's what they think about you. feel me? Like, we know M is ruthless, bro. Like, you don't need to play 10,000 quotes. You feel me? It's like this, like... Is this whole fucking thing gonna just be him? Fake smoking a blunt. You know, it wasn't like I had no idea that he was gonna take. I ain't never seen Nick hold up a blunt. My goddamn life. Nick Cannon was gonna start. This shit pissing me off. Think about it, punk motherfucker. He better say something good too. Doing all this. You've been disrespecting our queens for years. Matter of fact, won't you tell them how you really feel, Marshall? Black girls are bitches. Black girls are dumb. Okay, I'll give Nick that. But that would have been a way better intro than the shit he just did. But okay. Black girls are bitches. Black girls are dumb. What you say, Kim? Black girls are bitches. Black girls are dumb. You might win some, but you just lost one. Black girls are bitches. Black girls are dumb. What? Black girls are bitches. I kind of like the little beat though. I ain't gonna lie. But he finna make this. I already know he finna turn his trash. But I kind of like the little beat. Black girls in this house, but now you can't see swim. Had to put my motherfucker turban on. Outside your motherfucker turban on. Protesting with AKs and guns. Our queens don't need your racism. You just kick AK to the generation. No kick AK, did I take it too far? He's a ref. 
Oh. Run, nigga, run. Stand on my ground. Food up this long. I don't give a fuck if his ass was young. Can't let that slide. That's on my sons. I damn right. Yeah, I'm on one. Cause ain't no age. Four white rage. Typically in your DNA. I seen you at the VMA. Niggas that was with you. You treated them like indentured slaves. Read the paper. You racist. I see why you hate us. Pretend you love us. But you really jealous. Wanna be brothers. Christopher Columbus. Hip hop wish you discovered. Now I'ma slay you for my sister's yeah, cousin. Yeah, I'm with you. Stand on my courage. And no one. Thank you to bitches. What? I guess I can respect him more for this one than the other one. The other one just looked whack. And this one's still whack, but I mean, it's better, I guess. So. What? What you say, him? Catchy hook. You might win some, but you just lost one. You do not even sound like he needed to be on the mic. Motherfucker, what? We let you be a guest in this house, but now you cancel. Swirl. Just for Rosa and Coretta, Asada and Loretta, Betty, Rosetta. This nigga just turned the video into a fucking history lesson. <laughs> Hell yeah, Doctor Bethune, so Jonah, she the truth. I do it for the coach, a new Oprah in the booth. Oh, Jamal told your ass you was a guest in our house. I'm trying to find out who the fuck let this pest in our house. Close the door, apology tour for sure. They gon' say I'm right. I hate to say it, I'd rather have M in the house than Nick in that house. <laughs> Cause Nick. Ah, oh, Nick. Nick. <laughs> But I had to lure him with the hate just to read the same paper. You racist, I see why you hate us. Pretend you love us, but you really jealous. Want to be brothers of Christopher no. Columbus. Hip hop, wish you discovered. No, yeah. I'm gonna slay you for my sister's yeah, cousin. Stand up, my brother's in the water. Black girls are bitches. Black girls are dumb. What? Black girls are bitches. Black girls are bitches. What you say, him? Black girls are bitches. Black girls are dumb. You might win some, but you just, just lost, lost one. one. Black girls are bitches. Black girls are dumb. We let you be a guest in this house, but now you cancel. Swirl. You heard him. This is how you feel about us. I'm just gonna keep letting that ride. Oh yeah, the hopping bob and all the mother house Negroes that keep defending. Man, how you gonna call people who give Eminem his his props? House niggas are house slaves. What? That's racist. What you just said? This motherfucker. Come on, boy. Holla at me. I got some books you should read. Oh, and Marshall, I tried to give you an invitation. Uh, the invitation's canceled. But yet you still kept dropping this. You better pull up your bridges. Black girls and white girls just don't mix because black girls are dumb and white. Man. <laughs> Y'all, there are just some boundaries or some lines you just don't step over. And what makes all of this more hilarious, y'all, is that he did this and got no reaction from M. M didn't give a fuck. Like, what can you say to that man? Like, if anything, he know that he clowned himself. You get what I'm saying? It was no need to respond because he, he wasn't worth his response, y'all. That's the most disrespect right there. So all Nick did was just embarrass himself. I like I said, I give him his props. You know, some parts were decent, was good, it was better than the first. I tell you that. But like, it was still just a waste of energy and breath, bro. <laughs> y'all tell me what y'all think, man. Um, y'all make sure y'all like, comment, subscribe. Don't forget we're doing the first giveaway of the channel. I'm gonna go ahead and play the following clip. What's going on, Coco Mafia? We have surpassed 500 subs, and we are now on the road to 1K. And as I said before, I want to do a $100 cash app giveaway once we hit 1,000 subs, and the requirements are really simple. All you gotta do is follow me on all my social media platforms and make sure that you are subscribed to this channel and turn on your post notifications. Follow me on Snapchat, Instagram, TikTok, Facebook, and don't forget Twitter, y'all. Everything is gonna be listed in the description below in this video. And once you do all that, just comment, I subbed at the bottom of this video. Simple, I gotta believe y'all, we can get it, let's go. But those are the requirements. It's very simple, very easy. Um, and like I said, I appreciate those who keep watching, who keep returning, who are giving me support, who are commenting down below. Like I said, once you do everything, just comment, I subbed, or just, you know, something to let me know that you done did everything already, you know what I mean? So 
I appreciate y'all. Love y'all. You know, I'm going to keep dropping content. Just make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Turn on your post notifications, man. Like I said, y'all can't be Coco Mafia if you're not sub, bro. That's just not how that works. You have to be subbed to be a part of this familia. I mean, I still welcome you. I, I still think of you as my friend, if even if you're not sub, but still, like, it's just, why, why not do it? It's free. We've been through this. You feel what I'm saying? So, like I said, I appreciate y'all, and I'm going to come back with another banger soon. I'm out.